Hello there, you're looking at two angry BOS soldiers who just want to figure out what's better, T-65 or Hellcat. Meanwhile, I want to thank Senorito Will Blake, who became a supporter of my channel. Thank you, amigo. Well, objectively, T-65 is better, because he will receive less melee damage, and the difference between ballistic weapons is close to nothing, as you can see on your screens. But anyhow, let's test high damage resistance of T-65 versus 12% damage reduction of Hellcat. Ooh, kiss the kiss. Before I start testing, let me show you my stats, effects, and what do we have here? Nothing interesting. Well, mutations, and uh, that's all. Let's go and check perks. As you can see, mm, not much. I don't need camp fiend. No. And here, mm -mm, nothing. Electric absorption, just in case. Ciao, ciao. With perks, everything is clear. Well, today I will be using PvP mechanics to perform the tests. 254 hit points and a whole bunch of apps. One low damage dealer, two mid damage dealers, and two high damage dealers. Black powder rifles. Buzovoy, if you like my videos and want to see more of them, please help me with likes, subscriptions and comments. That is how YouTube shows videos to more people. Okay, the keys, let's start. First, I will shoot this noob with 10mm pistol. Actually, three times, but you can see only one. In the description it says 18 damage, the number we see upon shooting is 6, and actually I received 2 of 3 damage. Now I want to repeat the same with Brotherhood Rifle, 50 description damage, 26 what I deal, and only 12, 13 what I doubt. Basically I will repeat the same suspicious activity with all guns I have, and uh, once again, base damage is the one I see when shoot. The word base uh, doesn't sound good, right? Well, I just don't know how to call it. Basically, base damage is the one you have without any buffs. Power armor by default reduces 42% of income damage, ballistic or energy. So that is why it's more OP than normal armor with the same damage resistance. And if you deal 10 damage, there is no big difference between 250 damage resistance and 1000. So basically you don't need it crazy high. But if we deal 250 damage, the difference will be 20%. The question is who runs black powder rifle among mobs? So, we have 42% damage reduction because armor is powered, and we can add up here our eaters. 30% more damage reduction, still no dodge, no emergency protocols, no lone wanderer. Lookies dookies, uh, speaking of base damage here, it will not be changed for any weapon. But if you watched my previous video about Cavalier, you should know that it can be bugged not showing you the truth. If we compare directly T65 with and without overeaters, the difference is around 35% for any case here for any weapon. The last three shots and we can start with overeaters and see what's going on there. Of course, first I will PvP using not legendary version of Hellcat to compare the results with not legendary version of T65. Let's jump in. And by the way, here are the stats we have. Halo dude. Okay. 546 damage resistance versus 675 and a combo of 12% and 42% damage reduction versus just 42% in case of T65. The base damage of 10mm is the same and no difference in damage taken. Let's try a rifle. And here actually it gets low. 24 instead of 26. In this case, ballistic damage reduction provided by armor affected the base damage while over eaters didn't. Huh, interesting. As you can see, all damage taking numbers are a little bit lower, so here Hellcat is actually better. And it even gets super better with higher damage I receive. Well, now let's try over eaters version of this Gato Infernal. 
here we go and let's start with pistol for low damage makers there is no difference so maybe a little bit of difference we can see not here not in pv and actually the same about mid damage makers until we use something that does around 69 damage in the description you can see 9 damage taken instead of 10 black powder rifles do 2 damage less so we clearly can see that ballistic damage reduction provided by diabolskaya koshka power armor is op Let's see if another combo of damage reduction guys will make any difference. And here we have the G. 30% less damage taken at cost of 30 action points. And as well learn one rare. Here it is, 20% less damage. Let's try black powder rifle and see how different the damage will be. Boom! It drops two times and this is Hellcatch. And now I want to try the same but with T65, I just need to get into my power armor, here it is, okay buddy, boom, well Hellcat is slightly better here, but the difference will be unnoticeable, right, maybe it is too many numbers for today, <laughs> deposit a like and I will make another PvP test but with melee weapons, and for today I want to say a big thank you for watching, I will see you later. Bye 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 b